Hello friends, welcome back to our channel. So today's video is gonna be a lot of fun. I'm really excited about this one. So we thought we would show you what we got our baby for Christmas this year. So we wanna give you some ideas if you have a toddler or a baby, our baby's gonna be 15 months this month actually on the 13th of December, she'll be 15 months, which is crazy. I feel like I just had her. Um, so she's a baby and I guess a toddler as well. I still think she's a baby, but this is what we got her for Christmas. We wanted to show you guys because we thought it'd be fun to give you some ideas if you're wondering what to get your little one. So the first thing is that we have a tradition that I actually, my family used to do, and we're gonna carry it on to the Hicks pack, is that every year when I was little, every year um, my parents would get us three presents because baby Jesus got three gifts from the wise men, three wise men gold, frankincense, and myrrh. So we would always each get three presents. Obviously we'd get our stockings and stuff too, and then one present was always from Santa, um, but but we got three gifts. So this is what we did do for Annabella this year. This is the first year she's gonna get three gifts. Last year she was too little, so we only got her one thing, but this year she's got three. So let's start with the top. This one is already wrapped, which I think is so cool. So um, if you guys follow me on Instagram, um, you might have seen that I posted last week, I think it was, that we went to Last of the Moon Toys, which is like the most amazing toy store in Montana. Um, and a lot of the toys are unique. And so we found, Annabelle has been really into balls lately. Um, like really into it. She's like, every time she sees a ball, she's like, ball, ball, ball. Or Christmas tree ornaments. Yeah, she thinks Christmas tree, like little bulbs are balls. And she always tries to take them off the tree and be like, ball, ball. And so if you can see, our friends have a beautiful tree next to us and there are balls covering it. And so it makes Bella happy. But anyways, she loves, loves, loves balls. And so... But we have a dog. Yes, we have a dog. And she pops them. And dogs pop the balls. So we have to hide them usually. Or get a thicker or one. Or get a thick ball. So at Last of the Moon Toys, they had a really cute purpley ball with like little cute slots on it. And it's like, what do you call it? Recess at school. Yeah, it's like quality, the kind of like the that, thick rubber. Yeah, like they would use, like kids would use to play handball or like yeah, that's or a handball style ball. It's amazing, and I have always wanted to get her one like that, but I've never been able to find it. Like at Target or Walmart, they only have like those thin, really thin, cheap ones, which is fine. She likes them, but they'll die. Exactly. So we want to get her a thick, durable one. So at Last of the Moon, they are amazing there, and they offered because I was like, well, how am I supposed to wrap a ball? Like, because I, I knew I wanted to get her a ball. But I was like, how am I gonna wrap one? So they were like, we could wrap it for you. And so you guys check this out. It's so cute. Look at the little curly cue on the, the little ribbon. Oh, it's so cute. What color wrapping paper is that, babe? It's kind of like the green with little balls all over it, like ornaments, oh snowflakes gosh. in them, some polka dots. She's gonna love this. So they wrapped this for us, which I'm so excited. This is her first wrapped Christmas present and it's just so cute. And so she's gonna have so much fun. I cannot wait to see her rip this open. Like babe, can you just, aren't you just so excited yeah. to see her rip it? So mm -hmm. I'm really excited about this present. I cannot These wait. These next two are not wrapped. Yeah, they're not wrapped yet because I'm not that ahead of things, but I cannot wait for her to open this on Christmas morning. Now. The next thing, we just actually got these from Amazon delivered yesterday, which is awesome. This is called a pop-up pal. Um, I think that's what it's called, right? Maybe? The one where you push the button or yeah. turn the key or hit the switch and then the little animals pop up. Yeah, it's wrapped right now, but basically, well, it's wrapped in the packaging, but basically it's really cute because um, we live with our friends and they have two little boys and they have one of the boys has one of these. And there was like um, like a polar bear, like a bunch of different animals on it, like five different animals. And she would push the button and it would pop up and she'd laugh and go, wow. And every single animal that popped up, she would say, doggy, doggy. So this one does have a doggy. Yeah. And so I was like, oh, how cute. She thinks they're all doggies. And so I told Richard, I was like, we need to see if we can find a push or a, a pop-up pal that has doggies on it. And my friend was like, well, I don't know if they make those. But we looked and we happened to, on Black Friday, we found it. It was a deal. We got this and it was so affordable, you guys. I'm just gonna tell you because it was so amazing. It was like $10 for this. Um, Might be because it was Black Friday. Yeah, because it was Black Friday. So this is normally not $10. So that was a really good deal we got and it has doggies. So she's gonna love this so much and I'm so excited. Um, and yes, this is the main This show. is our her main big expensive gift. We do one expensive gift. We're a little bit low budget this year. So that's why we have some little stuff. But this, she's gonna love you guys. This is her final gift. It's not wrapped, but it's oh. packaging. Oh. I didn't realize that was the top. Fisher Price, it learning is kitchen. A kitchen set. Okay, you guys, this is gonna be. Oh, I'm gonna like cry with. I'm more excited about this probably than she's gonna be, but I'm sure she'll love it. This is a kitchen set um, by Fisher Price, like Richard said, 
And Annabella is at the age, because she's almost 15 months, if you have a little toddler, you know that um, they are very into the kitchen. And whenever like I'm in the kitchen emptying the dishwasher or loading it or doing anything, she is always up in my grill trying to climb in the dishwasher, grab all the things, and that is not good. So I'm always trying to monitor her out of the kitchen. And so I thought that this would be so cute to have because then we can set this up in the kitchen. And while mama's doing the dishes, Annabella can play in her kitchen as well. So this is really, really amazing. And I um, did some research and got her the best one I could find. Um, and this seems like such a durable, awesome one. And I'm really, really excited to give this to her. So these two things we're gonna wrap in pretty Christmas paper. I just haven't gotten it yet. I wanna try to find doggy wrapping paper. I'm not sure if I'll be able to, cause I want it to be Christmassy too. So we'll see. Maybe I'm not. sure there's something. But we'll try to find like some doggy wrapping paper cause that'll make her so happy. <laughs> She's like obsessed with doggies. And she so. did play with a kind of kitchen at a friend's house. They had an entryway with a big playroom and she was like opening all the cupboards and has a little frying pan on. So she was, she was really into it when she saw it immediately. She is going to absolutely love this. We also have a stocking for her and I'm gonna get her a couple little stocking stuffers. I do have a little maraca for her right now. Um, yeah. I don't have it with me right now, but it's just a little maraca. And so I'm, I'm trying to think of some other little ideas. It, actually, if you have any ideas for me, for little stocking stuffers for a 15 month old. Probably not candy. <laughs> no, leave them in the comments down below because you know, I'm kind of struggling with that. I know like, you know, she doesn't really need a lot of stocking stuffers this year just because she's young and really won't understand. But at the same time, I want to get her some because it's just fun to do that. And it's hard to get her little things because they can be choking hazards. So I'm trying really hard to think of little things that she would enjoy. So if you have any ideas, leave them in the comments. I would love to hear maybe what you got your baby or your toddler or your kids, any age that they are for Christmas. Share with me what you got them. We would like to know as well. That'd be really fun. So we really appreciate you guys watching. We are so excited. It's finally December. We are loving this month celebrating Christmas here in cold, snowy, beautiful Montana. It's been so amazing and magical, you guys. Oh my goodness. We've always dreamed of a white Christmas. At least I have. And I think we're going to get one this year. And I'm so excited, like beyond belief. We've already seen snow a lot. It's actually snow on the ground right now. Yep. There's snow on the ground right now. And it's just beautiful and I am in awe of this place. And so anyway, I'm really excited for Christmas this year. We hope you are too. And we hope you enjoy Christmas with your family and opening gifts under your tree and making some special memories together. So thank you so much for watching this video. If you liked it, go ahead and give it a thumbs up. That helps our channel out so much. And like I said, leave your gifts in the comments, your ideas. And we, um, if you haven't subscribed yet, we'd love for you to join our pack here. Um, we make videos every week and we'd love to have you. So thank you again for watching and we will see you in next week's video. Bye guys.